Where was this team in the first game? Welcome, everybody. Welcome to the Drex Hawkins Halftime Blitz. I'm going to go through the notes that I made, and we'll see how the rest of this game plays out. But so far, I'm liking what I'm seeing. All right, first things first, four flags on the team. If this holds for the next half and we wind up with eight, I'm going to shit a brick. The guys need to pull it together, and we'll get into why. All right. Short opening kick. That was smart. Put the ball as close as you can and make them work for their yardage. This is necessary and it has to happen going forward. Excellent. It is an excellent strategy. You got a, the second kick was not so good. You gave basically 30 yards to them. I understand end zone is what it is, but I like that short kick. Keep that up. All right. Moving forward. Garrett. A little jumpy, got that first flag there. Everybody was actually a little jumpy. I don't know if everybody else noticed that. Look, discipline and control is key, especially when you're working defense, all right? Make your enemy get the flag so you don't have to. It is free yardage. Keep that in mind and keep doing what you're doing, but tone it down, guys. Keep that discipline and control. Foreman had multiple great plays. Foreman was moving forward the entire time. I counted four times that he hauled his ass in the first quarter to move that ball forward. Moore also exceptionally strong. Three good catches moving forward still. And I got to talk about Moore there for a second. Look, the man shrugs off hits like a man. He just ste he just steamrolls forward like a legend. This guy is going up against dudes that are head taller than him and still continues to perform excellently. Did last year and is still doing the same. I like that. Keep that up. All right. Uh, ba 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 ba. All right, Watson made a key throw to Judy. That was a key saving pass. Good call in the clutch right there for that decision making. Where was that the first game, man? We're going to touch a little bit more about Watson here as we go down through this. Another good throw to Bell. Watson for s somehow managed to pull it out of his ass and make some actually decent plays here. Ford, he has balls. He is small, but I tell you what, he is not to be trifled with against these larger guys. He can push his way through no matter what. Love seeing that. Good 16-yard play, and he pushed forward again and again. Number 88. Uh, we were second down with and made eight yards, and that was a hard move on the outside, but an excellent play. Good work. Uh, Watson was sacked one time. That is a lot better than what we saw in the first game. We saw, what, three, four, five times the man got sacked? That is an excellent change from before. Uh, also, he scored a touchdown. So, I'll tell you what, that's what we're paying you to do. You are making millions of dollars to win. Keep making touchdowns, keep scoring points, keep getting to the end zone. That's what we like to see. Uh, da -da. 21 had a great save with only a minute 44 on the clock. Uh, totaled around that out was 15 plays to the first. And I tell you what, that is a significant improvement from the first game. Leaps and bounds ahead. Congratulations. God damn. All right. Moore continued in the second quarter to take big hits and shrug them off. Watson actually scrambled. I didn't know the man could move off his ass. Good for you, buddy. All right. He had a good throw to Cooper. Well, I, well, he made a good throw to Cooper. Cooper is the one who failed to connect that pass. And I tell you what, it's his fault, not Watson's. I don't say that lightly. All right. Hopkins, 53-yard kick. Good as always. The ball just explodes off of that boy's foot. We made an excellent choice getting you, kid. All right. Uh, we also had an excellent return kick. That flag was bullshit. Uh, I believe that should have been a turnover. Uh, sue me. All right. 88. Oh, this is another one. This is something I think a lot of people might have missed. 88 showed superb, excellent sportsmanship. I do not see this often, but the man lent a hand to the opposing 
team to a Jaguar that he tackled, you don't see that all that often. Good sportsmanship. I like to see that. Sportsmanship is an excellent point that I like to see on a personal level. Have to point that one out. All right. Uh, Jaguar number one was let through. Sorry, I didn't catch the guy's name. I'm not a fan of, of that team, so I don't know his name. Uh, Jaguar number one was just let completely through. Where was the defense? You guys need to close those gaps. You were strong overall, but that one was a mistake and a failure. You need to correct that going forward. You need to tighten up and maintain that cohesion. You had it for the rest of the game. I don't know what happened there. There must have been a lapse in judgment. Correct that. Emerson, so close. You were so close, but you don't get credit for close. You get credit for winning and being there, not for close. No more to say on that. Koromoa did a blitz. That is a man out there that is getting work done. He might not always do something, but when he does, it is meaningful Defense has been strong, exceptionally good so far in the first half. Ford, seven seven yards was, was a good call from him and Watson to make that play. And a 63-yard rush, if my numbers are correct on that one, that was madness. 63-yard gain is insanity. Excellent job. He earned his pay today. All right. Watson is actually moving and communicating. This is something that I pointed out in the first uh, failure video that I did for, for game one. I mean, th there's actually been some leadership. I think he is stepping up and actually trying to take the place. It's early, only the first half. But I tell you what, if this continues, I'll have, I'll have a few more praises to sing for him. I might. I might have a few more praises to sing of the man. All right. Drawing out the clock is a legitimate strategy. All right, I I have seen I've seen a few people wondering, well, why didn't you go for it? Why didn't you go for it? Look, here's the thing: you have to draw that clock out when you're at the very end because you can make a kick. If you get the extra points, you get the points. Plus, it comes right back to you at the second half. Excellent, legitimate strategy. Garrett to end it all up, a superb tackle. Absolutely, what we are looking for and what we need on this team. Overall. I am impressed. This is a marked improvement from the last game. You guys need to keep this shit up. This is what Browns fans have been dying for and have been begging for since last season's high. This is what we need to see. Now, it's the Jaguars. They were ranked lower than us. But I tell you what, from what I've seen... Maybe they finally got their shit together. Only time will tell. Thank you very much for watching. I've been Drex Hawkins. Thank you very much for watching the Drex Hawkins Halftime Blitz. Have a good one, everybody.